All right, thank you, Tyler, or Chuck, rather. <laughs> Illinois Republicans packed the Illinois State Fair director's tent for a rally, kicking off their 2022 campaign season. Capitol Bureau Chief Mike Militich is live in Springfield tonight. And Mike, how was the turnout today? Well, Amber, Republicans here in Illinois feel they have the momentum going right now to change the political landscape for Illinois and Washington, D.C. But their main goal, fire Governor J.B. Pritzker. Republicans hope to add more members to Congress and the Illinois General Assembly. They're also aiming to take back Illinois by winning the races for state constitutional officers. Is everybody with us? Yeah. Let's let today be the day that Illinois Republicans begin the march to victory in 2022. Of course, the biggest race next year will be for the governor's mansion. Currently, three Republicans have plans to unseat Governor J.B. Pritzker. Former Senator Paul Schimpf says Illinois is a phenomenal state that just needs new leadership. We have an infrastructure that is unmatched. We have the resources, we have the talent, we have the people to be the strongest state in the country. The only thing that's holding us back right now is a dysfunctional government that doesn't know how to innovate and doesn't know how to exercise some fiscal restraint. Shim says people will see a new direction and say in the state if he becomes governor. Meanwhile, businessman Gary Rabine hopes to keep businesses in Illinois. He also believes he'll gain support from some Democrats and moderates. I think a lot of them don't, don't believe that it's okay to shut down businesses. I think a lot of them believe it's not okay to, to, to tell our kids or parents they must do this or that or mandating, mandating, you know, mask or anything. While each of the candidates gains traction, Senator Darren Bailey had the largest group of supporters at the GOP rally. Many have followed the Southern Illinois lawmaker since his court battles with Governor Pritzker over executive powers. However, Bailey feels he has helped inform people across Illinois who didn't understand state politics. His next goal, getting hesitant voters to get to the polls. That's our constitutional duty, and I think the uh, silent majority is out there. Uh, we just got to find them, and we got to encourage them and empower them. State GOP Chairman Don Tracy says he doesn't see a frontrunner for the governor's race just yet, although we do expect several others to join that governor's race, and they could announce within the coming weeks or months. For now, reporting live in Springfield, Mike Militich, 25 News.